a wise decision for you to surrender. I didn't have much choice. Oh, nonsense. You could have chosen to let your people die. However, you chose to be a Jedi. Predictable. You follow a long history written by the Jedi where they choose what they believe to be morally correct, instead of what is strategically sound. And yet the Jedi have survived. Hmm. The Jedi once numbered in the thousands. What's left are a scattered, frightened lot, mostly beaten and in hiding or poorly trained children like yourself. I must admit, the mysteries of the Force are an enigma to me. But for all those abilities, all the power, the Jedi lacked the vision for how to wield it. The Force isn't a weapon, but you'll never understand that. Oh, I don't have to. It was not my intention to utterly destroy Lothal, but that is inevitable now. These are a few of the artifacts I've gathered from your home world. I saved what I could. I have even taken some of Sabine Wren's work. She's quite talented. Or was quite talented. You think you can take whatever you want? Things you didn't make? Didn't earn? Things you don't even understand? You don't deserve to have this art or Lothal. Who deserves what is irrelevant. What matters is who has power. But that is something that yet I won't teach you, so I'll take you to someone who will. My Emperor. I have brought you Ezra Bridger. My dear boy, I've so wanted to meet you. And here you are, at last. 